The state continued to present its case today by detailing for jurors what was going on inside Terrell Thomas's cell at the county jail. The jury viewed this picture of the cell's bone dry sink. A Milwaukee police detective described arriving to find Thomas dead on the floor. Was there anything that it appears that Mr. Thomas had anything to drink? There was not. No bottle of water, no milk, sink didn't work? Nothing. Thomas died in the jail overnight from April 23rd into the 24th, 2016. A week earlier is when prosecutors alleged Thomas flooded his previous cell and James Lee Ramsey Guy shut off water to his new one at the direction of a supervisor as punishment. Milwaukee County's deputy chief medical examiner says that's why Thomas died. Since the water was turned off in his cell and he didn't have access to water, uh, I determined that uh, it was death at the hands of another, and uh, I determined that the manner of death is homicide. But during cross-examination from Ramsey Guy's lawyer, she added no medical checks on Thomas performed during the seven days after the water was turned off reported symptoms of dehydration. And in your review of the records from Armour, the medical providers for the jail, and specifically for Mr. Thomas during this period of time, there's no indication there in those records that he had either dry lips or dry mucous membranes. Is that a yes, fair statement? I, I didn't see it in the records. Ramsey Guy faces up to three and a half years behind bars if found guilty. At the Safety Building downtown, Pete Zervakis, today's TMJ4.